Good evening. Hello, guys. Good evening, teacher. Give me a second. No problem, Walter. Hi, teacher. Alfonso, hello. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Hello, pretty, hello. pretty well, teacher. <laughs> That's good. Tell me, how do you hear the microphone? Vamos a probar micrófonos. ¿Cómo me escuchan con este? Good. What about this one? ¿Qué tal con este? Better. Better? Okay. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Excellent. Okay. Hold on. Teacher. Hold on. Just tell me. Yeah. Pongo la cámara, solo termino de... Eh, no problem, no problem, no problem. Thank you, hello, teacher. <laughs> hello, Vladimir. How are you? Good, teacher. How about you? Here, here, fighting with Zoom. Doesn't have the capac capacity. The capacity? For, the capacity for <laughs> change your... <laughs> And how do you do it? ¿Cómo lo hace? Nothing. No, 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 but how could you do it? ¿Cómo podría hacerse? Ah, es que uh, toque en Spanish. Creo que usted se va a opciones de video. Ajá. Y ahí le dice seleccionar fondo virtual. Oh, I just saw it. Yes, that's right. Uh -huh. Okay, but I got none. No tengo ninguno. You can use some image, I, I guess. Maybe English Corporativo or at background. We'll see, we'll see. Actually, uh, I don't use that. Uh, Fondo Virtual. Yeah, background. I will look one. No, but in my case, it doesn't appear. Ah, uh, sorry. In my case, no me aparece fondo virtual. There appears none. Aparece ninguno. Ah, uh, really? Well, maybe we can we can ask to Mauricio. He use a lot of background. Yeah. So, how are you, mister? Good, teacher. Today was relaxed. Oh, really? Why? Yes. Oh, well, you are not taking your wife. Yes, that's the first. Now, at my job, my boss are on vacations. Oh, really? Your she, boss is yes. on vacation? Yes, she returns on Tuesday. No, sorry, on Thursday. On Thursday? Thursday, yes. Well... What? Cool. Uh, uh, when when the cat is dancing here, the these yeah. are fiesta. <laughs> yeah, they make a party. <laughs> so so you are free. Yes. No news, good news. I told you. No news is good news. Well, yes. Yeah, in your area, it, that's the way it is, right? Right. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. I am trying to change a little something here. Teacher, the homework for the description of the mission and vision of, of the job is for this. This week? Yeah, right? This week, yeah. right? Okay. Yep. A PPT, a video. Hey, there it is. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Oh, you're in the highs. Yeah, this is better. It looks more comfortable. <laughs> Yes, the only problem is that it will diminish the resolution of the video in order to keep 
de, de, de wide, de, de bandwidth. De bandwidth. Yes. I guess it consumes a lot. Yeah. But we'll see. We'll see. It looks better. It actually okay. looks better. So, how are you, mister? Okay. I'm okay, teacher. That's great. That's great. So, your wife is having three... 72, 72, day, 72 days since... Um, Uh, 19 March from from from, from to March 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 19 yes to to uh, I guess 31 March uh, May 31st May 31st that's yes. cool good for me good yeah I can imagine I can imagine I uh, I save gas yeah, you are saving gas. I, you are. I prefer travel by bus. In my case, believe me, uh, whenever I used to travel by bus, I used to read more. Actually, Hi. I can really. Read, uh, yeah, I can read in the bus. And um, <laughs> you approach what do you say? I take advantage. I take advantage for take a little nap. Uh, well, you know, there was a time when I used to travel like uh, un tiempo cuando yo viajaba like uh, three hours by bus where Maybe. I used to and I could read all the way. Y yo podía leer todo el camino. Yes, it's a... Uh... It was fun. For me, it was fun. No, it's... It was far. Uh huh. Yeah, a little bit. Yes. A little bit, a little bit, but mm, I mean, a tired trip. Yeah, it was tiresome. I used to leave my house around two or, well, around two thirty p.m. And I used to arrive to my to the place where I used to stay. Y llegaba al lugar donde me quedaba at seven. 7, 7, 15 p.m. Wow. It was a long trip. Yes. A lot ago. But it was fun. Era divertido. You take, you take advantage for read something. Yeah, for reading. For reading something. Good. Yeah. It was great. Well, interesting. Thank you very much, Vladimir. Okay, teacher. Ivania, hello, welcome. How come you are so early at home? Come on, Diego, Hi, teacher. Good evening. Tell me, tell me. What me did you do? Estrella porque por fin me conecté temprano. Yeah. What did you do today? ¿Qué hizo ahora? I find um, um, a lot of work. Um, coordinator and status and the shipping. Okay, shipping uh, status, shipping status. Shipping status. Um, lo, lo de siempre, teacher. The usual. The usual. Okay, that's cool. And how did you do to be home that early? Como le hizo para estar en casa tan temprano? Ay, señor Jesús. <laughs> uh, we left the office early to the fumigación. Yeah. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Well, that's good. It's good that you you took advantage of that. Es bueno que aprovechó eso to be in the class earlier. Yes. About uh, leave a lot of work painting um, también um, I'm back home a lot of traffic so tomorrow is going to be difficult mañana va a estar duro yes wow. what can we do que le vamos a hacer <laughs> welcome to the class madrugar como se había dicho to wake up early despertarse temprano yeah 
That's the only <laughs> way we have. Well, thank you, Vania. <laughs> Mr. Ruiz, hello, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. How's everything? So, so? We were missing you yesterday, lo extrañamos. <laughs> yeah, uh, I had problem with the phone and all the information for the class I had there. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. All the apps were closing. This is really annoying. So you couldn't connect because you didn't have access to the data. Yeah. Oh. All, all my information is on phone. Oh, yeah, that's a problem. That's always yeah. a problem. Oh, but, <laughs> it's, problem. but it's good to have you here in class today. It's yes. great. Excellent. Thank you. Let's see, there's, and tell me, tell me, Walter, what about today? How was your day? What did you do today? Mm, very relaxed. Many, many manifestations. Parades? Yeah. In Guatemala. In Guatemala? Yeah. Uh, maybe in the old route, the people close to street yeah i don't know why but for me it's relaxed okay actually in this case it's not great these uh demonstrations what demonstrations manifestations demonstrations si usted busca la palabra manifestación exactly va a encontrar manifestation but mm -hmm. in this specific case, lo que se está hablando son demonstrations. Demonios. Demonstrations. Demonstrations. Oh, demons. Ah, demons. Yeah, demonstrations. No demons. No, no demons. No <laughs> demons. Come on, man. Uh, I don't know why, but they love demons. Okay, well, thank you, Walter. Welcome to the class. Okay, sure. Let's see. Edwin, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm tired. And tell me, Edwin, how many hours have you slept? ¿Cuántas horas has dormido? Two hours. Say what? Two hours? Uh, the, to 5 p.m. at 7 p.m. Ooh, yeah. Well, let me see. In my case, I slept like I slept from 12, 1, 2, 3. Oh, well, I have slept just three hours since yesterday. Yo solo dormí dos tres. Oh. So we are in a competence. Yeah, <laughs> similar. Yeah, because early in the morning I have to go like around 3 30 to El Tunco. Then I have, uh -huh. I have to come back. Uh, because there was there was going to be a, an event for my niece. Iba a haber un evento por, por la situación de mi sobrina. Oh. Today. And then I went just to drop somebody. Solo fue dejar a alguien. Then I came back. I went to work at 7.30. I was already in my other job. A 7.30 estaba acá en mi otro trabajo. And let's see. I've been working all day. And today, as soon as we finish the class, tan pronto termina la class, around 10.30, I need to go all the way down to Suchitoto oh. to pick up somebody a recoger a unas personas and then I'm going to be home around 12 oh. and after that I will upload the video of this class y después de esto tengo que subir el video de la clase so I think I'm going to sleep around another three hours tonight creo que dormiré otras tres horas oh. it's, I think I'm going to win Creo que sí le voy a ganar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because you, in your case, as soon as the class finishes, you crash. Sí. That's yes, cool. Yes, That's cool. You got to relax. Let me see. Tomorrow I need to be in my job at 7. Y mañana tengo que estar de nuevo a las 7. So, it's fun. Very uh, hard. <laughs> uh, but it's not all the time. No es todo el tiempo. Just once in a while. Well, thank you, Edwin. Nice to have Thank you, you here. Mr. Luis Armando Leiva, hello, how are you? 
How are you, teacher? I'm Good doing evening. great. Good evening. How are you, mister? Well, uh, fine. I fine. Going to, I, yeah. I had a... Uh, well, uh, I had a little bit today. Oh, really? But very... Yeah, but very good day. Well, I arrived at the office on, at 8 a.m. And I cleaned my desk um, and I was uh, during the day, uh, I was writing. Uh, during the day? Uh, during the day, I was writing a uh, work plan, as he says, plan de trabajo. Yes. Okay, work plan from for a uh, Chalatenango project. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, it is uh, uh, for some weather system study. Oh, operators, really? operator the the world systems. So you've been busy. And, you've been quite busy. I yeah, we yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but it's a normal day for me. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Wow. But what I, can we do about it? ¿Qué le yeah, vamos a hacer? Yeah. Sí. Así que estamos listos. That's cool, that's cool. It's good to have you here. Es bueno tenerlo acá. Gracias. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see, let's see. Who else is around? Sonia, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm How? so <laughs> Why so so? Por qué so so? I have, um, com, how do you say, día desgastante? A tiresome day. A tire. Eso no es cansado. No, tiresome. Es tiresome. Eso es desgastante. Yeah, a tiresome day. Okay, a tiresome day. Tell me why. Um, I had to check cases with the problems in coordination and attention. Okay. Uh, I meet with a client. I met. Follow, I met. Yes, I met with a client to follow up uh, the different, como, how do you say, diferentes temas relacionados a, a nuestra interacción, o sea, diferentes cosas. No casos específicos, sino que varias, varios asuntos que necesitan seguimiento, como decir. Okay. Topic. Top related to our interaction. Okay. And hold on. Some situation needed a follow up. Oh, okay. Man, you really make me sin. Think. Siempre me hace oh. pensar, Sonia. That's cool. Le diría lo siento, pero no. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, no, it's cool, it's cool. So everybody can get new vocabulary. Es bueno que todos logremos okay. nuevo vocabulario. And, and right now, uh, I don't uh, have connected in my, compu in my computer. Uh -huh. Why not? And, um, I don't know. ¿Por qué no? Estoy intentando, uh, ¿cómo se dice? Estoy intentando y no, no conecto. I am trying. I am trying. And it doesn't uh, connect. ¿Cómo? And it doesn't connect. Yeah, and it doesn't connect. Uh, but of uh, my, my cell phones? Yes. Si conecto? But in my cell phone, I can. But in my cell phone, I can. Uh, but, eh, ¿cómo es no puedo? But I cannot. But I cannot eh, activar la cámara. Activate. Activate, Activate the camera. 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 
Camera. Camera. Camera. Yep. Ok. Así las cosas. Ok, well, thank you. It was interesting. Ok. Ok, let's see, let's see, let's see. Arvin, hello Arvin. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hi. Um, I, I am a light tired. A little bit tired? Yes. Why, man? Um, what I, did you do today? I am, I am on my, my way home. Okay, never mind then. Entonces no se preocupe. I'll talk to you later. Hablamos luego. There's Susana. Hello, Susana. Hi. How are you? Good. Better. How was your yesterday? How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo el día? Tranquilo, relax. Very relax. I don't, I don't do, I don't work a lot today. I, I didn't, say, I didn't. I didn't. Pasado. Okay, I didn't a lot work today. Como digo, descansé mucho. I rested a lot. I rested a lot. Oh. Okay, well, thank you, Susana. Welcome. Evelyn, hello, how are you? How are you? I am fine. What about you? ¿Qué tal usted? Fine. fine, teacher. Having dinner. Más o menos. <laughs> Don't worry, never mind, later. Okay. Okay. Sandra, hello, Sandra. Miss Sandra Janira, hello. I think she's got problems. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see. I got everybody here. I got Mauricio, I got Alfonso, Susana. Let me get the attendance, please. Let's see, attendance. Alfonso Antonio Cabrera. Present teacher. Arvin Enrique Ramos Mundo. Present teacher. Berta Maritza Molina absent. Claudia Guadalupe Alfaro absent. Daisy Elizabeth. Oh, she's absent. Edwin Daniel Sevillano. Present teacher. Thank you. Evelyn Patricia Caballero. Present teacher. Thank you. Ivania Elizabeth Rodriguez Ramos. Present teacher. Karen Lisset Garcia Rodriguez. Luis Armando Leiva Rodas. Present teacher. Mauricio Arnoldo Quintanilla Cuellar. Oscar Armando Rodríguez Rodríguez. Ricardo Alberto Hernández Monge, absent. Roxana Claribel, absent. Sandra Yanira Moreno Sarabia. Sonia Mabel Lazo González. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Thank you, both of you. Gracias, Alma. Vladimir Antonio Martínez Molina. Present teacher. Walter Alexander Arana. En Walter José. Say Ruiz Ayala. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Let's see. Okie dokie. Let's see, guys. Well, today we're going to talk about uh, phone calls. Yesterday, do you remember, we were practicing a conversation in which there was a phone call. ¿Se recuerdan que ayer hablado, teníamos una conversación con una phone call? And today we are going to see vocabulary related to the phone call. Okay, vamos a ver vocabulario relacionado con phone call. That's very interesting, actually. Let me share with you. Déjenme compartirles. Okay, okay, let's see. Here it is.
Okay, guys, let's see. Today, I'm sorry, it's not class 16, it's class 17. I don't know what happened to me. No sé qué me pasó. Okay, the regular telephone you have in your house is called a landline. Eh, las líneas telefónicas. The telephones we have in our house or perhaps in our office that got connected with a cable, las que se conectan con un cable, they are called landline. That way we differentiate it from a cell phone, okay? A cordless phone is not connected by a cord. It's what we call uh, inalámbrico, cordless, cordless. Less in this case is an affix that means sing, okay? So a cordless phone is not connected by a cord. Now, when someone calls you, the phone makes a sound. Cuando alguien les llama, the phone makes a sound. We say the phone is ringing. Ese sonido es ring. So we say that the phone is ringing. If you are available, si usted está disponible, you pick up the telephone or answer the telephone. Okay? These two verbs mean the same. In this situation, they are used the same way. In este caso, se usan igual. Pick up the telephone or answer the telephone. Okay? In order to talk to the person who is calling you. Questions here? Preguntas acá? No? Okay, let's continue. When you want to make a phone call, you start by dialing the number. You dialing the number. You dial a number, okay? So, listen up. We got two different situations. First, you pick up the phone or answer the phone, right? Dial. Dial comes, that expression, that verb comes from when the time when, well, some of you don't remember that. Algunos de ustedes no conocieron eso. But some of us have and use those phones that we used to dial, okay? And the verb still supply. Y, una, y el verbo aún se aplica. When you dial a number in your cell phone, okay? Cuando nosotros decimos marcar un número. That's to dial, okay? Questions? Preguntas? No? Okay, let's continue. This vocabulary is very important because we use it a lot. Mostly we work in... Teacher. Teacher. Yes, Adeline? Dial, dialing is the same as dialing. Dialing is marcar? Yep, dialing. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's continue. Okay, so you dial the number. Let's imagine that you call your friend, but he or she is already on the phone with somebody else. Imagínese que le marcamos, pero la persona ya está on the phone. This expression, on the phone, like, hey, imagine that somebody goes in and asks, hey, where where is where is Susana? And somebody else says, oh, Susana is on the phone. Nosotros decimos está en llamada o tiene una llamada o está al teléfono, right? That expression in English is on the phone, okay? Or imagine that somebody is looking for Sonia and Sonia says, hey, I cannot take, I will not be taking calls for one hour, I will be on the phone on a conference, okay? So when you say I am on the phone, that means en llamada. Let's continue. Okay, oops, I'm sorry. Then you will hear a busy signal. If you call somebody, si usted le llama a alguien, and that person is on the phone, on another phone call, en otra llamada, you will hear a busy signal. 
a busy signal, busy, ocupado. Busy signal. That's a beeping sound. A beeping sound. Un sonido mm, beeping. That tells you the other person is currently using the phone. Un sonido que nos dice que la otra persona está using the phone. Okay? Now, sometimes when you call a company or when you console, when you call somebody, they put you on hold. Now, let me explain this. A veces cuando le llamamos a alguien, or perhaps we call a company, like the bank, like Figo, like Claro. Some companies, you make the phone call and they put you on hold. Lo ponen a uno on hold, en espera. Okay? For a lot of minutes, teacher. Yeah, I to know. To call to Figo. Yeah, that happens, that happens. They put you on hold. Nos ponen en espera. Okay? What does it mean? That we listen to some music or to some ads or quizás algún anuncio or some information from the company, but you are on hold. And if you call somebody, imagine that uh, that you call Vladimir and you tell, hey, Vladimir, hello, how are you? Hey, look, I need to talk to your wife. Can, can you connect her? Me puede conectar a su esposa? And he tells me, y él me dice, hey, yes, hold on. Hold on a sec. That's another expression. He could tell me, hold on. Actually, hold on es el verbo que quiere decir sujetarse. But we use it para decirle a alguien, espere. When somebody makes a phone call. Cuando alguien nos hace una llamada, le decimos, hold on. ¿Ok? O cuando so estamos... Sure. Yes? Uh, sorry, if you can say to, uh, she's busy right now. Yep. Do you want to wait her? Wait for her. Ah, do you want to wait for her? Yeah. Or you can say, can you hold a second? Okay, thanks. Can you hold a second? Now, hold a sec. That's an informal... Pro uh, yes, Sonia, tell me. Hold on es lo mismo que wait for me. En este contexto nada más. En este contexto nada más, cuando estamos hablando de llamadas telefónicas o cuando uh -huh. estamos, imagínese que usted está hablando con Evelyn. Están en oficina, tienen una reunión y llega corriendo, llego corriendo yo y le digo, eh, Sonia, I need to talk to you. Y usted me dice, eh, hold on a second, please. I need to finish this. Ok. okay. In this context, you can use hold on, like to say wait. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is it clear? Más o menos. ¿Cuándo es que puedo? En este contexto lo entendí que es mejor aplicar hold on, pero ¿cuándo entonces wait? Uh, cuando es su jefe el que llega. Ah, okay. es como wait for me es más formal. Yeah, it's more polite. Pero si está en una phone call, si está en una llamada telefónica, you can say, hold on a second, please. Okay. Oh, hold on a minute, please. Deme un instante, yeah. deme un momento. Okay. In a phone call, you can use hold on. Okay. Or imagine that... Hecho, a, el botón de hold. Yeah. Or imagine that somebody calls your house asking for one of your kids. Imagínese que llama a otro niño a uno de sus hijos a la casa. And you answer the phone. And... And you tell the kid, you tell the chico, oh, hold on a second, please. Espera un momento. Yeah. And we do the typical, no, we put the hand on it and we yell. Mm -hmm. Lo tapamos y gritamos, right? Mm -hmm. okay. In that situation, it applies. Actually, yeah. hold on means this. Sujetar, agarrar algo, okay? That's hold mm -hmm. on when you... Hold on to something. Cuando usted sujeta algo. That's hold on. Okay? okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you. No more questions? Shall I continue? ¿Puedo continuar? Yep. Perfect. Thank you. 
Now, finally, when you're finished with the conversation, you hang up. Now, look at this verb. When you are finished with the conversation, you hang up. Cuando terminó la conversación, you hang up. Okay. Hang up is the action that you finish it and you hang up. Or you cut the connection. Cuando se corta la, o interrumpe la conexión. You hang up. Like, you know, you know, Vladimir, Sonia is a bad person. The other day I called her and she hanged up. Uh, she hanged up on me. Oh, really, teacher? Yeah, yeah, you know, she's... Come rude. on, Sonia. She's very rude. She's very rude. Oh. Oh. Okay, you see? To hang up on someone, to hang up on, y luego el nombre de la persona, o el, o el sujeto que describe a la persona, to hang up on es colgarle a alguien, ¿ok? That's not to finish the conversation. It's like, I don't want to talk to you and you hang up. Or like, there's always a relative, siempre hay un familiar that you call them and when they finish talking, they don't wait for you. They always hang up first. Siempre hay alguien de la familia que cuando le llamamos, este, cuando ellos terminan de decirnos lo que quieren, they hang up on us. Siempre nos cuelgan, right? Yeah, that's normal. There's always somebody who's like that. So, they hang up on you. Questions? Preguntas? No? Perfect. Teacher, could you share the, the presentation? I will. I will. Don't worry. Thanks. I will. I will. Yo se la voy a compartir. Don't worry. It was just because of time. Solo fue una cuestión de tiempo that I was coming from down there, like uh, somewhere. Venía de camino, that's why I couldn't share it with you before the class, but I will at the... I will tonight. Lo haré ahora. I don't know if at midnight when I come back, si no lo hago an antes de irme, around midnight. Alrededor de medianoche, okay? But I will. I will. Don't worry. I will do it as soon as I get back home. Tan pronto regrese a casa, I will send it, send it to you. So let's see, questions about this? No? Okay, guys, let me just check on something in my plan. Solo déjeme revisar algo en my plan. It's, sure. Yes, mister? Este, ahí leí hold on, pero yes. también leí on hold. Okay. On hold. Si usted está on hold, está en espera. Ok. Hold on es cuando yo le digo. Hold on. Es cuando yo le digo, espéreme. But imagine that you are in a phone call. Imagínese que usted está en una llamada. Y lo pusieron a esperar. And you are like waiting, waiting. Y viene alguien y le pregunta, ¿Eh, ¿qué pasó? ¿Te, ¿Te lograste comunicar? Y se le dice, oh no, they got me on hold. They got okay. me on hold. Ellos me tienen Como llamada esperando. Yes, they got me on hold. Okay. Okay, perfect. Oh, thank you. Good, good, good. When there's questions, it's bueno cuando hay preguntas. It's actually excellent. Now, let me see. I was checking my lesson plan. Okay, let's see, let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we are going to do something else. We will go to the lesson plan, to the, I'm sorry, to the manual. Vamos con el manual. Because we got something, a little something to do there. Let me just tell you which page. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We are going to go to the manual. If you got your manuals in page number 42. Si tenemos el manual, vamos a la página 
42. Okay. Okay. Now let me share it with you. Si no, se las comparto. Okay, we have the conversation here. Now, okay, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner. So you are going to listen to the conversation right now, and then we are going to practice it with a partner, okay? And it goes like this. I'm just sending it to everybody. That's if you got encounter any trouble. And the conversation goes like this. It says, Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see, I'll be there right away. I will repeat, guys. Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mr. Choa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see, I'll be there right away. Okay, guys, now we're gonna go to practice. Hi, Elizabeth, welcome. Hi, teacher. On your way home, the Camino Casa? Manda. You home already? Ya llegó a casa? Sí, teacher, eh? problema perfect. con mi inter. No están arreglando. Okay, perfect, perfect. As long as you stay in the class, no problem. Okay. Perfecto. okay, guys, we are going to do the exercise. Just let me get Elizabeth in the attendance. So I'm going to put her in the attendance. Okay, she's been present. And also Mr. Arana, Walter Arana. Say present, Walter, please. Present, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Okay, perfect. I like it when there's a lot of you. Me encanta cuando bien todos. That's great. Now, let's see. We're going to work in groups right now. You, I sent you the conversation. Let's see. Let me create a group. Okay, 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 okay. Oopsie. No, no, like this. Like this. Let's see. Perfect. Please, guys, jump in. Let's do it. Okay. Mike Hernandez, it at the department. Hello. IT, IT. IT. IT department. Ah, sorry, teacher. 
Hello, my. Hi. This is Maria Ochoa from a company. I would like to report a problem. Report. Why... Report. Report. Thank you, teacher. A problem. Why my? With. 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 My printer. What? <clears throat> what is the problem, Mr. Ochoa? It doesn't. It does seem to be working, and it is making a strange. 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 Is there a message message in the control panel? Yes. It says service. Also, there is a red light on the error book, error button. Error button. Error button. Thank you, teacher. I would like you to come some to check it. I see. I, teacher? Yes, continue. I don't know. You can switch. I, I see. I'll, I'll. 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 I'll be there right away. Right away. Right, right away. Okay. I, One. You start. Thank you. My Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I will, I will like. I would, I would. I would, would? Would. La L would. no suena. No me le ponga sonido a la L. Would. Okay. I would like to. What is the problem, Miss Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strong noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the error. Service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see I'll be there right away. Okay, I start. Mike okay. Hernandez, the perfect. Hello, my, this is Maria Ochoa from a county. I would like to report a problem with my printing. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't to be working and is making a strange noise. Noise. Is there a noise? Noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes. It says service, also there is red light on the error button. I would like you to come, son, to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. You will start, Elizabeth? Okay. Mike Hernandez, IT department. IT. Hello, Mike. IT. Okay. Mauricio. Ya no está. Bueno, seguimos. Mike Hernandez, okay. IT de... Mike Hernandez, I Oh. That's my voice. Yes. <laughs> I sound Horrible. Que feo suena. I see. I'll be there right away. Right away. Yes. <laughs> bueno, voy de nuevo. Dele. Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it is making a strange no noise. 
What is the problem, Miss Oshawa? I doesn't seem to be working. It doesn't. Um, it, it doesn't. It. Ah, it doesn't. Sí, I, 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 it, it doesn't. Ya va a terminar. It doesn't <laughs> seem to working at it's making a strange noise. 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 Is there a mention in the control panel? Message. Message. Me, me, message. 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 Yep, like that. Message. And remember, it's a question. Is there? Is there? Es una pregunta. Is there? Mishka. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello, guys. Hello. Let's just wait for everybody to come back. Esperemos, ya vienen. Okay. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Let's see who's gonna start. Okay, Ivania and Sandra, you are going to start. Oops, and Evelyn is still stuck there. Okay, you need to Sandra. Hey, perdón, si Sandra. Mike Hernandez, IT department. IT. IT department. Uh, IT department. Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Miss Ochoa? It doesn't seem to the to be working. Uh, it is making a string noisy. Noise. Noise. Thank you. Is there mesha in the control panel? Así es, teacher, mesha. Is there a message? Mesha. Message. Is, I know. Is there a mesha in the control panel? Yes, it is a service. Also, there is a red light on the error, on the error button. I would like you to come soon to the check it. I see, I'll be there right away. Oh, anyway. Right away, right away. Right away. Perfect, very well done, very well done. Now, Evelyn and Sonia. Who starts? Uh, okay. Evelyn starts. Okay, Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike, this is Maria Ochoa from Accountant. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Rochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the error boot button. 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 I would like you to come soon to check it. I see. I will be there right away. Very well done. Let's see. Sonia, accounting, accounting. Accounting. And it says, says. Says. Yep, says. Okay. Thank you. Now let's see. Next group is going to be, and Walter L. Luis Armando, Walter Ruiz and Luis Armando Leiva. Please, okay. Walter, you are going to start. Sure. Okay. In a second, Maya Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mr. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. 
Also, there is a red light in the hero bottom. I would like you to come through to check it. I see. I, uh, I'll be turned right away. Okay. Perfect. Very well done. Muy bien hecho. I'll be there right away. Right away. Elizabeth and Susana. Susana, you will start, please. Okay. Hello, my. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printing. What is the problem, Miss Ochoa? It doesn't to be working and it is making a strange noise. Strange. A strange noise. Is, is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Or there is a red lie on the error button. I would like you to come so to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. Okay. Error button. Error button. Error. Error button. It doesn't seem, Elizabeth. Error it, button. Yes. And the phrase, it doesn't seem. Okay. Now let's see. Vladimir and Edwin. Okay. Uh, you started with. Okay. Uh, Mayor Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the ever bottom. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. Thanks. Thanks. Perfect. Pristine. Excellent, guys. Now, let's see. Let's see. Walter Arana and Alfonso. Okay. okay. Mike Hernandez. IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. Where is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it is make a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says say service. Also, there is red light or the error button. I will, would like you to come some to check it. I see. I'll be the right away. Right away. Right away. Error button. Error button, Alfonso. It doesn't seem to. It doesn't seem to. It doesn't seem to. Now, Susana and Arvin. Arvin, you will start, please. Okay, teacher. Mike Hernandez, IT department. IT. IT. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from Accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Miss Ochoa? It doesn't seem to the work to be working, and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see, I be there right away. Perfect, thank you very much. Very well done, guys. 
Excellent pronunciation. Listen again to the pronunciation. Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see, I'll be there right away. Okay, guys, now let's continue. Let me share something with you, okay? Right here. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, I hate when this happened. We already seen this and this. And what we are gonna work right now is this. Okay, would like to, would like to, plus, we can use would like to, plus a verb. Podemos utilizar el would like to con un verbo, okay? Remember, this is me gustaría, gustaría, okay? Now, look, examples. I would like to have a cup of coffee, please. I would like, me gustaría, to have a cup of coffee, please. I would like to watch TV right now. I would like to watch TV now. Remember, we are expressing a desire. Expresamos un deseo, okay? Look now, would like to plus a noun. También lo podemos utilizar con un nombre. Examples. Let's check some examples. I would like a cup of coffee, please. Do you remember the first sentence was, I would like to have a cup of coffee. I would like a cup of coffee, please. Aquí desapareció el tú. Why? Porque cuando tenemos el tú es porque luego viene un verbo. Okay? Look. I would like some lemon juice. Or we can say lemonade. Is the same. Lemon juice and lemonade is the same word. Now, when we make a question using would like to, look, when do we use it? In interrogative form, it's used to offer something. En algunas ocasiones lo utilizamos para ofrecer algo. Teacher. Yes. Cinco, cinco trap way to hold its quality. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Repeat again. ¿Cómo fue? La oración contractada, ¿cómo sería? El verbo, se puede contractar. Aid, aid. El who. Yes. El who. It's like this. Aid. I'd like to. That's the contractal form. Aid. Contractamos el would con el sujeto. Aid. And we pronounce it I. No problem, no problem. Any other question? ¿Alguna otra pregunta? No. Let's continue. Continuamos. Okay, examples of this. Would you like a cup of tea? Would you like a cup of tea? Le gustaría. What would you like to drink? ¿Qué le gustaría tomar? Now, want to plus verb or plus anon. Remember something. When we say want to, we are expressing the same as would like to, but more informal. Now, it's like this. Es como esto. Hey guys, Vladimir, I want I want you to 
make your presentation, your final presentation tomorrow. Okay? Sorry. That's, that's informal. Es una, ah, okay. Es un request informal. No, but that's true, actually. Oh, really? Well, yeah. <laughs> I guess it was an example. No, no, no. In your case, I'm going to ask it from you. Se lo voy a pedir a usted. Uh, según mi plan, I have organized okay. it. Okay, no to problem. Be you, it's going to be Edwin, and it's going to be... Uh, será Edwin, usted, and let me see who is the other one, and Evelyn. Okay. The three of you go for tomorrow. No problem. Fi the final homework. Do you remember, guys? ¿Se acuerdan del final homework? Vamos a hacer, perdón. <laughs> Evelyn, my <laughs> No, repeat, please. The final homework. Al inicio del curso les dejé una actividad final. Where you sí. were supposed to give, to make a presentation of your company, right? Yes. Ustedes me iban a hacer, se iban a presentar la compañía. Okay? In last <laughs> level, you did it about yourself. En nivel pasado lo hicieron about yourself, de ustedes mismos. Now is your company. Okay? Yes. So, okay. Vladimir, Edwin, and Evelyn go tomorrow. Okay. If you need help, you can send it to me. Si necesitan ayuda, me lo pueden enviar. Okay. And I can check it. If you have it on written, si lo tienen por escrito. But afternoon, después del mediodía, because the whole morning, I'm going to be in a meeting. Voy a estar en reunión toda la mañana. And that, that would be a problem because, sería un problema, because if you send me the message, perhaps I just check it and and swipe it. Puede ser que solo lo ocurra. Well, okay. okay, teacher. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. okay. And the rest of you guys be ready. Y el resto de ustedes estén listos. Okay? Because there's going to be one of you that is going to be a surprise. Uno de ustedes va a ser sorprendido mañana with the request. But like me today. Yeah. <laughs> Me no too. It's easy, it's easy, it's easy. Actually, you are going to help your classmates. Ustedes le van a ayudar a sus compañeros. Setting the example, poniendo el ejemplo. That's going to be cool. Don't worry, don't worry. Okay. So let's continue with the presentation, please. Oh, I'm sorry. I was explaining something. One, two. So I can tell Vladimir like that. Hey, Vladimir, I want you to present your, your final homework tomorrow. Or I can say, hey, Vladimir. I would like you to present your final homework tomorrow. If you notice, when I say, hey, Vladimir, I want you to present your final homework tomorrow. That's informal, okay? Like friendly, teacher. Yeah, that's friendly. If I say, hey, Vladimir, I would like you to please present your homework tomorrow. That's it's polite. Polite. That's a formal request, okay? Es una petición formal okay if you make it a question si utilizamos el would like to dirigido a otra persona en una pregunta puede ser un ofrecimiento okay like hey Edwin would you like to be the first tomorrow or the last le gustaría ser el primero o el último with the presentation Yes. The first. Cool. The first. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you. You see, it was a an offering. Le ofrecí the chance to be the first or the last. Okay. Questions? Preguntas? No? We cool? That's nice. Let's continue. So we say that want to is the same as would like to, but more informal. Let's see. Examples. I want a cup of coffee, please. I want a cup of coffee. You see, this is informal because we say, I want a cup of coffee, please. I want some lemon juice. Okay, that's a request, an informal request. That's something that you do with your friends, perhaps, or an, 
en an informal situation. Eso lo hacemos con los amigos en una situación informal. Look, I want I want to have a cup of coffee, please. I want to have a cup of coffee. Now, listen to something. I am pronouncing. I want to have a cup of coffee, please. But want to remember, if you are in an informal conversation, you pronounce it wanna. I wanna have. I wanna have a cup of coffee. Look, I want to watch TV now. Now, want to, you use it to say you want someone to do something. Okay? The same as with would like to. Example, I want, oh, I'm sorry, there was a mistake. Perdón, aquí hubo un error. Este tú no debe ir. I want her to help me with this work. I would like her to help me with this work. It's the same, just that this one is informal, okay? Questions? No questions? Okay. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, en la... En la última eh, presentación, yep. eh, el her, eh, ¿a qué iba referido? No entendí esa parte. Ella. ¿Podrías ayudarle? No, I want Asesoría. her, I want her, quiero que ella. I want oh. her to help me, ok, pero en esta situación, I'm sorry. I want her to help me. Okay. I want her to I help. want her to help me. Uh -huh. The problem Quiero with que ella yes. me ayude. Yes, exactly. Um, Act actually, it's realmente es deseo que. No. The only problem is this. And guys, be careful. Esto es para los caballeros. Uh, well, ladies also. We never say I want her and I want him. Normalmente no decimos solo así, I want her or I want him. No decimos la frase así corta. Because that implies a physical desire. ¿Ok? La expresión así de simple, I want her or I want him, expresa, puede, puede interpretarse como deseo físico. So be careful. ¿Ok? Do you understand me? Sí. ¿Sí? Yeah? Okay, perfect. So it could be inappropriate. Podría ser inapropiado. Well, depending on the context. Dependiendo del contexto. Okay? And, and don't tell nobody I want you. Okay? No me le van a decir a cualquier persona I want you. That could be misunderstood. Puede malinterpretarse. Okay? I want you to help me. I want you to come with me. I want you to work on it. ¿Ok? Siempre le ponemos algo más. ¿Questions? No? Perfect. Excellent. Task. Our task. Nuestra tarea. Nuestra actividad. Our task for right now. A conversation. You will create a conversation using would like to or want to. ¿Ok? Remember, it's a regular conversation. It doesn't mean that you will use would like to in all the conversation. Recuerdense, es una conversación normal. No quiere decir que me lo van a utilizar en todas las participaciones. One or two, it's okay. But you will create a conversation. You'll be working in groups, groups of three members. You will have 10 minutes to create that conversation. Tendremos 10 minutos para crearla. Okay? So let me see. Let me change something. Okay, it's going to be. Ooh. Perfect. Groups are created. Guys, please, let's do it.
Hello, teacher. Do you me yep. sacó de un grupo y me metió? Ah, okay. Yep. I I needed to. Okay. Because we are waiting also for Elizabeth. Esperamos por Elizabeth. Okay. Let's hope she can connect. Como escuchó, tiene problemas de conexión. Sí. Okay. RB. Phone. Hola. She's on the phone. She's on the phone. Oh. She's on the phone. She uses on the phone. She's on yes. the phone. She's on the She's phone. On the phone. Okay. I see. Okay. Okay. Hello, Susana. Comencemos. Start. Elizabeth, are you there? Hola, hola, hola. ¿Me pueden explicar, por favor, que se me cerraron los ojos? Ah, ok. Este, hay que hacer una conversación y hay que usar I would like to y I want to. Eh, Vladimir, I'm sorry to interrupt you. Perdonen que los interrumpa. Vladimir, eh, today at the end of the class, could you stay for 10 minutes, please? Ah, yes. No problem. Thank you. Excellent. Thank you. I'm fine, Arvin. Um, how about you? How about you? Entonces tú me contestas. I'm okay, por ejemplo. Uh -huh. I'm okay. Entonces tú me ahí decís tú, look, uh, Elizabeth comes here. Hey, la saludo. Uh -huh. Hello, Elizabeth. Hello. How was your day? How was Fine, day? thank you. And you? Uh -huh. Okay, entonces podemos. Sandra. ¿no? Teacher. Yes. Hi, guys. How are eh, you? Ayúdenos con algo. Yes, tell me. ¿Cree que nos puede mandar la... Los... ¿Cómo decirlo? Los... Eh, la presentación. Yeah, in a group. In a group. Uh, I would like to, uh, I want to. I want to, sorry. Okay, just give me a second then. Solo de mi un segundo. That I, I, don't, ayude un poco. I don't usually have the WhatsApp open. No, lo, no suelo tenerlo abierto. Uh, Not here in the computer. Teacher, se ve como que está en la playa. Oh, I wish I were. Desear estar. No, no, no right now. No realmente, no en este momento. Así pensé yo. Yeah, I love the beach. Me encanta la playa. Ay. Okay. Okay. okay, it's connecting, man. It's connecting, but it's going to take us a few seconds. <laughs> I got so many screens open. Tengo tantas pantallas abiertas. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. It's loading, it's gone. Ah, it's okay, loading. thanks, teacher. You're welcome. Oh, it's a crazy and beautiful idea. Ah, you're the one. Yes. What do you think? Hello, Walter. How Good are week. you? I'm fine. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine. Sonia. I, huh? I am fine. I'm Yo no estoy escribiendo. <laughs> me regaña a mí? ¿Ve? I'm fine. Qué oh. Es la costumbre, Sonia. La costumbre. <laughs> Ella tiene que ser, Dios <laughs> No, eh, no what, digo si quiere puedo dejar de compartir no problem. No, no, it's <laughs> no. Hey, Alfonso. Hi. Walter, capital. You need to use capitals. Capitals. Capital. Mayúsculas. 
cat pirata. Ah, uh -huh. Walter. The okay. name. Hello, Walter. You see up here? Ya no. lo veo. Yes. La W. Sorry. Yes. Cat I'm sorry, guys, but in your case, this is basic too. I am more demanding. Soy más demandante. Sí, no. Y así tiene que ser. Okay, um, now, in this case, a suggestion, una sugerencia. Hello, Walter, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. What about yeah. you? What about? Yeah, what about, about you? you? I'm fine. I am busy. Um, what you can do to help, uh, to help him, lo que pueden hacer para ayudarle al que está visitando is send your sentence on a message. Envíele su oración en un message del, del Zoom. Okay. Ah, sí, es cierto. Ahorita lo voy a that way he ah. just copy paste. It's easier. Así se le hace más fácil and faster y más rápido. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Ya, ya vio Sonia, ya vio y usted decía que no. Uy, que chica, no yo, ¿verdad? Yeah. Uy, chica, ¿verdad? As usual, como siempre. <risa> <risa> ah, ahorita le escribo. Vamos mm, entonces con ese tema. Hola. Oh. Seguimos con ese tema. Ivana. Bueno, sí, podemos, podemos seguir. Evania, that's a good exercise for vocalization. Es un muy buen ejercicio para vocalizar. Just a little bit backward, un poco más atrás. <laughs> próximamente, próximamente. Si me <laughs> Hello, girls. This is Evelyn. This is Evelyn. Okay. Is Evelyn. I would like to ask for information about your works, no, your jobs. Si le dice your job. works, son unos trabajos que ellos están realizando, proyectos. Oh. Ver. Okay, your job is... What presentations would you like? Would you like? Pregunta, would you like? Okay. Would you like? Okay. Okay. En el caso ahí, Ivania. Sería. Um, about. About. ¿Cómo podría ser para contestarle qué presentación le gustaría? Eh? Yeah, acerca sí. de, about, acerca de. Um, sería. Sure. Transporte de carga, ¿cómo se, ¿cómo se diría? Sorry. Transporte de carga. Uh, low transport or low transport. Si puede poner este Evelyn. Uh -huh. And bowls or drink or um, bebible, drink a bowl and bowls. Okay, guys, cuando tengamos palabras así que son muy related to your job, what you can do, lo que pueden hacer es para ayudarle a quien está typing, you can send the, the sentence, pueden enviarle la oración en el chat from this from Zoom, pueden mandarle la oración en el chat de Zoom, así la otra persona just. Copy, paste. Thank you. Teacher, excuse me, no le escuché lo de transporte de carga. Low transportation. Low transportation. Okay.
tocar de las de, la, de ambos lados o comentar usted okay. About the drink, the drink of Ivania, I, I just sent, I just sent a better expression for you. Le acabo de enviar una mejor uh, expresión. Freight transport. Freight transport. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Like, do you remember the, the the brand of the trucks? Ha visto la marca de los camiones? Freight liner. Mm -hmm. Línea de carga. Ah, okay. Oh, freight liner. Yep. Freight liner. Mm -hmm. So, freight okay. transport. Freight transport. Okay, that's it. Freight. Okay. It's friendly, Diego. It would like is, is para polite. Por eso como, si se fija, yo usted le saludo. Hello, Elizabeth. How was your day? Ah, fine, thank uh -huh. you. So, you say, would you like? Okay. Okay, I am starting. I'm okay. Look, Elizabeth is coming. Ah, okay. Is coming. Elizabeth is coming. Yep. Coming. Thanks, teacher. Okay. Okay. Hi, Vladimir. How are you? I'm fine, Arvin. How about you? I am okay. Look, Elizabeth is coming. Hello, Elizabeth. How was your day? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm okay, Elizabeth. Would you like to join us for lunch? Sorry, is just Elizabeth. Sorry, Whoa, you? Elizabeth. Why, Elizabeth? Why, Elizabeth? Why, Elizabeth? Because I am going to lunch with my mom. Ah, okay, no problem, Elizabeth. Arvin, we want to invite you, Elizabeth, in another occasion. That sounds great. Bye, guys. Have a nice day. Bye, Elizabeth. Enjoy your lunch with your mom. Okay, guys, perfect. Now, Elizabeth, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Así pronúncielo. I'm gonna. Está bien escrito. Así está bien escrito. Solo que... No, 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 no. no. I'm going to. Yeah. Uh -huh. Going to... ¿Cómo? Gonna. No. Going to se pronuncia gonna. Ah, perdón. <laughs> ok, sorry. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Have lunch. I am gonna... Teacher. Yes, no, sir. No, eh, quería listen. preguntarle cómo se pronuncia cuando dice say. Yes, Elizabeth. Say. How you or say? How you or would you? Would you? Would you? Would you? Would you? Yes. Okay. Would you? Vladimir, would you? listen to me. Okay. I am. Sorry. I'm going to have lunch with my mom. To have lunch. Lunch with my mom. Okay. Perfect. Now, Elizabeth, listen to me. La pronunciación okay. es. I'm gonna have lunch with my mom. I'm gonna to have lunch no, ah, with ah, my ah, mom. Ah, 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 ah. Listen to me. Vaya leyendo y escuche. I'm gonna have lunch. Going to se pronuncia gonna. Okay. Ah, ya, ya, perfecto. I'm gonna have yes. lunch with my mom. I gonna have lunch with my mom. Perfect. Excellent. Hey, teacher, thank you. Okay, now when okay. we go, I don't know how you're gonna do. No sé cómo le van a hacer, se la comparten, because in the presentation with the group, I don't want you to share. No me la van a compartir la imagen until you finish, hasta que hayan terminado la conversación, okay? Yes. Perfect. I'm gonna share the screen. Excellent. I'm gonna share the screen. Better. La montaña. Finish? No. No. Come on. Teacher, teacher, tenemos a Sonia, se nos está inspirando. Por favor, eso no es de siempre, hay que aprovecharla. Ok, cool. 
<risa> más que ahorita ¿Cómo digo puchica en inglés <risa> más que ahorita so, soy soy stranger teacher soy strangers la persona nueva I, I, I the new in the city <risa> G. 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 No, Sonia. Ah. ¿Cómo? G. Así digo. <ríe> Pensé que no existía o que no se iba a poder. <ríe> no, es que sería como decir G, man. Ok. O G, guys. Ok. No solo la expresión G. Ok. G, guys. G, guys. Ok. Gigas. Ah, yeah, no. that, that one she will remember. So I know, I know. Esa sí no se le va a olvidar, yo sé. No. No, no se va a olvidar. ¿Y cuánto nos falta? Hurry up, two minutes. No, 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 espérame, Five espérame. minutes, teacher, please. No. Five minutes. Va, espérame, ahorita. Ahorita mismo teacher. le pasa. Alfonso, ahorita se lo, le pasa. Va, déle, mándeme. Okay. Soy stranger. <laughs> will have me aparecen, they will have. They will, will have. have. Yes, they, they will they. have. Okay, teacher, thanks. Always yes, will object. They will have. Oh. I like, I like, no. I would like some pupusas. I would like. Yes, I, I would, like. would, would, oh, would, I would like. Sorry. Like hey. some, some pupusas. Yes, some pupusas. Hey. Okay. ¿Qué le parece, teacher? Let me see, Edwin. Good morning. What would you What would you like to order? I would like a cup of chocolate. And for eating, and for eating. Oh, sorry. Eating. Recuérdese después de for siempre si pone un verbo va en ing. Ah. I want pancakes. Quítale el tú. I want pancakes. pancakes. Okay. Plural. Plural. Pancakes. Yes. Okay. I like, erase the A, I like scrambled eggs. Scrambled eggs. Plural siempre. Yes. Y le quito la A. Oh, God, yep. Please. I like scrambled okay. eggs and a cup of coffee, please. A cup of, of coffee. Coffee. Oh. And you, Mr. I would uh, like. Well, this is a key teacher. Yeah, well. Well. No, no, no. And you, Mr. In this case, no well. Okay. Okay, Seria. Yep. Okay. okay. And you, Mr. Uh, 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 no, that's okay. 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 And, And you, you Mr. Mr. Capital. Mr. es un título. Va con inicial mayúscula. La M es mayúscula. Yeah. Perfect. I would like some pupusas. Tendrán, they will have. Oh. No, in this case is, do you have? Do you have? Okay. Do yes. you have? Do you have? Do you have? Hurry yes. up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Sure. Hello guys, what happened here? ¿Qué les pasó con Vladimir? Se salió, dijo teacher. Why? Que iba a otra sala. I said two minutes. Dije dos minutos. Okay, we can go back to the main room. Pueden salir y salirse al salón principal. Okay, teacher. Vladimir, I said two minutes. Dije dos minutos. Sorry, teacher. We scared it. <laughs> no problem. No But problem. We practice. Don't worry. We practice. That's cool. That's cool. You ready, Arvin? Ready, teacher. Okay. You're going to be first, guys. Van a ser los primeros. No problem. Perfect.
Okay, let's see, let's see. Vladimir, Arvin, and Elizabeth, you are first. Please, let's start. Okay, give me a minute. I'm going to share the screen. Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec, right. Okay. Arvin, you start. Okay. Hi, Vladimir. How are you? I'm fine, Arvin. How about you? I'm okay. Look, Elizabeth is coming. Hello, Elizabeth. How was your day? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm okay, Elizabeth. Would you like to join us for lunch? Say yes, Elizabeth. Would you? Sorry, I can. Why, Elizabeth? Because I gonna have lunch with my mom. Ah, okay, no problem, Elizabeth. Arvin, we want to invite to Elizabeth in another occasion. That sounds great. Bye, guys. Have a nice day. Bye, Elizabeth. Enjoy your lunch with your mom. Bye. Perfect. Bye. Just, 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 just a little detail. We want oh, sorry. to invite Elizabeth, not to Elizabeth. Okay. Okay. The only, the only detail, the only detail. Okay. Very okay. well done. Excellent pronunciation, guys. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank now you, let's you. see. Next group. Evelyn, Ivania, and Susanna. Hello, ladies. Evelyn, va a compartirlo. Ahorita voy a compartir. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Un segundo, please. No problem. Okay. Un segundo que no me deja compartir. Hoy oh, sí. Ahí está. Eh, comienzo yo. I will start. I will start. Sorry. Hello, girls. This is Evelyn. I would like to ask for information about your jobs. Evelyn, what would you like to know? I wear a freight transport. Susana. Hi, Evelyn. In my workplace, make medicine and vitamins. I would love to know about vitamins, Susana. What presentation? Would you like? I would the drink, drink cable samples. Even your company, it called Frank Transport Medicines? Depends, Evelyn. Need to be permission review. Okay, perfect. Just let me make some little details. Uh, hello, girls. This is Evelyn. I would like to ask for information about your jobs. Evelyn, what would you like to know? I work in freight transport, transporte de carga, freight transport, okay? Hi, Evelyn, in my workplace, we make medicines and vitamins. We make medicines, erase two, perfect. Medicines and vitamins. Yeah, I would like to know I would like to know about vitamins. Vitamins. Vitamin. What presentation would you like about the drink cables and poles? And poles. And poles. Ivania, in this case, 
it's a question. Could your company, freight transport medicines? Could your company? Could your company erase it, please? Erase? Erase it. No, it means el iris. Okay. Todo. Could your company freight transport medicines? It depends, Evelyn. Okay. I need to review the permissions. I need to erase the S. I need to review the permissions. El review en presente. Yep. Hasta aquí. Hasta aquí, yep. vea. Yep, 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 yep. To review, teacher, y lo demás. I need to review the permissions. Así, póngase al final. Yep. Permissions. Ok. The problem is that if you express it like that, it should have been like this. Si no, tendría que haber sido así. Permissions need to be reviewed. Okay, permissions need to be reviewed. But that's, uh, hmm, permissions need review. to be reviewed. Yeah, pero eso ya es voz pasiva. And Tengo that's, una what? Aquí no sería we need, porque está hablando de la empresa, de nosotros. Permissions need to be reviewed. No. Porque ok. La el permiso, no. Okay, no, okay, no. ok, 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 ok. Los permisos necesitan ser revisados. Uh -huh. The problem is this, Sonia. Eh, Depending on how old are we, dependiendo de qué tan mayores seamos, somos vos, algunos de nosotros, la voz pasiva es más común o más difícil para algunos. Voz pasiva uh, es algo que van a ver en, déjenme ver, en intermedio 5, algo así, y lo van a analizar nuevamente en avanzado. La voz pasiva enfoca se enfoca la atención que el verbo expresa no en el sujeto, o sea, no en quien ejecuta la acción, sino en el objeto de la oración que es quien recibe. Es un rollo. Ok. The thing is this. We don't, in Spanish, in Spanish actually, passive voice didn't exist before. Antes no existía la voz pasiva en español. Actually, it belongs, it actually belongs to English and French. Pertenece más al inglés y al francés. And... A few years ago, it started being adapted into Spanish. Debido a la globalización, este, nos hemos ido adaptando a esa manera de pensar. Because in English, they think that way. En inglés sí se piensa de esa manera. And it's quite common. But you are going to analyze it. It's just that it's a little bit more complex, grammatically speaking. Es un poquito más complejo gramaticalmente. Si se los explico ahora, eh, no tendría mucho sentido para ustedes y los confundiría más. Necesitan tener un mayor dominio del speaking. Al tener un mayor dominio del speaking, you are going to have a better command of understanding and thinking. Van a tener un mayor dominio del entender y, y pensar in English. And it's going to be quite easy for you. Y va a ser super fácil para ustedes. But if okay. I explain that to you right now, uf, si se los explico ahorita, I mean, I used to teach it. Yo lo enseñaba en... Uh, lo enseñé en gramática comparada a nivel universitario. So, no right could now for you. Teacher, could you bring an example of the voz pasiva in Spanish, please? Ok. Activa. Eh, look, guys. Yo, ah, com yo compré este teléfono para Vladimir. Voz activa. Ok. Activa. Pasiva. Este teléfono fue comprado para Vladimir por mí. It sounds a little bit weird in Spanish. 
son un poquito raro en español. This phone was bought for Vladimir by me. In English it makes completely sense. En inglés se tiene todo sentido. But that's something thank that you. you're, you're going to encounter further along. Okay, don't worry you. about it right now. No nos preocupemos por esto ahorita, okay? Don't worry, don't worry. Right now we need to focus on something else. And we need to focus in the conversation of Edwin, Luis, Sandra, and Walter. Hey, teacher, compartiré la pantalla. Share, share. I will share the screen. I will share the screen. Perfect. Okay. Hello, good morning. Welcome to Paradise Restaurant. What would you like to order? Sandra. Microphone. I would like a cup of chocolate. 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 And for feeding? And for feeding? I want pancake. I'd like a scrambled eggs and a cup of coffee, please. Please. Okay. Okay. And you, mister? I would like some pupusa. Do you have? Yes, I do. I would like two trees and two ayote de maíz. Okay. <laughs> Wait a moment, please. Okay, perfect. Corn, Walter. Corn. Corn. Corn, maíz. Okay. Corn. Perfect. Oh. Very well done. Excellent. Uh, excellent context, actually. Muy buen contexto. I like it. Now let's listen to Alfonso, Sonia, and Walter Arana. Okay. Alfonso. Alfonso. Lo perdimos. I think so. Creo que sí. En serio. Se fue. Nah. It's in action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> we'll give him time. Perhaps he's somewhere. Okay, uh -huh. guys, let's see, let's see. Remember, when we use would like to, if it's an affirmative, you are making perhaps like, I would like to, I would like to, I would like to explain something to you. That's, I'm sorry, Sonia. Okay. I would like to, Oh, disculpe que estaba escribiéndome a Alfonso, que no, no, pero no le entendí qué es lo que decía. Ok. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I don't know why. Oh, he's connecting again. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. One problem, one connection. Ok, let's do it. Uh, ok. Yeah, aquí. Hello, okay. Walter. How are you? I am fine. Thank you. What about you, Sonia? I'm fine. He is my friend Alfonso. We want to know a good Mexican food restaurant. Can you recommend one? Yes. They can go to the Tapatillos. Alfonso, you are new in the city? Yes. But I would like to know more place, for example, beach and mountains. Well, I can accompany you on the weekend. If we would like you to join, join, join us. Uh, see you this weekend. Okay, let me check something. Hello, Walter. How are you? I am fine. Thank you. What about you? I am fine. I'm fine. He is my friend, Alfonso. We want to know a good Mexican food restaurant. Can you recommend, recommend one? 
Yes, they can go to the tapatillos. Alfonso, you are new in the city. Yes, but I would like to know more places. For example, beaches and mountains. Well, I can accompany you on the weekend. I can join you in the weekend. I can go with you in the weekend. You can say, I can join you. Join or go? Join uh, is better. Join. Is. O-I-N. Yeah, I can join you. Erase, you. accompany. You. Uh, okay. Okay. Borreme el. I need you to erase this. This, this. Accompany you. ¿Dónde está? Well, I Ahí can después join del cursor. <laughs> después de él. Ahí donde tiene el cursor. Ahí es. No, no lo tiene él, es el mío. Esto. Ah. No, up, one up. No, una arriba. Acá. One up, yes, right there. One up, one up, one I up. can join you on the weekend. I can join you in the weekend. It's Walter participation. Es la participación de Walter. Yes, ¿Esto? that one. Mm, no todo. Escuche cómo debe quedar la oración. Okay. I can join you on the weekend. Raise your company, Joe. Yep. Like that, perfect. We did it. If we would like you to join us. Okay, este if, el if es un sí de condición. Ah, okay, entonces es yes. Yes. Okay. We would like you to join us. See you this weekend, perfect. Excellent, very well done, guys. Now, you, with teacher. the if, let me explain something to you, guys. Sonia, I lo rendí. Okay. Let me just clarify something. Déjenme aclararles algo. And it's very, very, very important for you to understand. If I... If I get vacations, comma, I will go to the beach. Look at this sentence. Can you see it? La vemos bien. If I get vacations, I will go to the beach. This word in this case. It's a conditional. Esta es una oración condicional. So, this is a condition. Listen. If, desde el momento que tengo el if, tengo una condición. Okay? Look. If I get vacations, si tengo vacaciones, I will go to the beach. Iré a la playa. This is the problem is that in Spanish, we use the same word, C si, for both situations, for an affirmation and for a condition. But in English, yes is an affirmation and if is the one that starts a conditional clause. El if lo utilizamos para comenzar una cláusula condicional, okay? And I know that some of you get anxious. Y sé que algunos de ustedes se ponen ansiosos. Be patient. You will get to it. Tengan paciencia. To the conditionals, you will get very soon. A los condicionales van a llegar muy pronto. Okay? Uh, you're not going to be with me, I think. Creo que no van a estar conmigo, but you will get there. Okay? And it's very simple. It's very simple. Just remember. If means C, si, but in a condition. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Ah, si tengo vacaciones, si tengo vacaciones, ¿ok? 
si tuviese vacaciones, si hubiese tenido vacaciones, siempre el S, el IF, acompaña la cláusula condicional. Las oraciones condicionales son oraciones que tienen, se dividen en dos partes, una condición, un resultado. ¿Ok? Entonces es importante que recordemos, ese IF es sí de condición, nada más. ¿Ok? Yes is an affirmative. So, in this case, en este caso, there was just one little thing missing. Era, solo faltó una cosita. Cuando estamos escribiendo, eh, yes, coma, and then the sentence. ¿Ok? Remember okay. that. Remember that. Why? Because after yes starts the sentence. ¿Ok? Remember, please. Now just let me check on something. Perfect. Questions about would like. No questions? Perfect. Vladimir, tell me. What would you like to do for vacation? Well, if I don't work on vacation, teacher, we will go with my family. We will go out with my family. Okay, perfect. I have a condition, sorry. <laughs> yeah, no problem, no problem. What about you, Sonia? What would you like to do for vacation? No problem, no problem. Da, da, da. Okay. Um... I would like uh, uh, um, um, no sé, no tengo plan, no se me ocurre. That's Pero why. Es, es por eso. No le estoy preguntando un plan. Si le preguntase un plan, ah. el present continuous. Do you remember? Yes. That was last week's classes. That's why I'm uh -huh. asking you. A desire. ¿Qué es lo que desea? Desearía. What would you <laughs> like? Ni siquiera dormir. Okay, I would like to rest. I would like to rest. Okay. You see, it's very simple. I would like to rest. Me gustaría dormir. Okay. Or you can say, I would love to. Me encantaría. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. What about you, Edwin? What would you like to do for vacation? I would like to no working. <laughs> oh yeah, you can work. <laughs> I would like listen to me, Edwin. In your case, it's a beautiful sentence, the one you got. Es una oración muy bonita la que tiene. I would like not to work. Like this. I would like would not, not to not work. To work. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I understand you. What about you, Sandra? What would you like to do for vacation? I would I would like to to go on the trip to trip travel on a trip travel but... yeah oh, well on a trip if you would like to travel where would you like to travel Sandra I like I would like Canada oh I would like to go to Canada Canada let me see Niagara. Niagara Falls. Yeah, go to the Canada side. The other side is not good. El lado bonito es el de Canadá. Si se va al lado de Estados Unidos, it's not nice. No. Canada. ¿Qué mes estamos? January, February, March, uh, December, January. Okay. Nah. Spring. Primavera. Cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this month is awesome. December is not. It's cold. No. Okay. Free. Thank you. Thank you, Sandra. Walter Arana, what would you like to do for vacation? Tell me. I would like to travel North Hollywood, teacher. North Hollywood? Yes, mm. in Los Angeles. Yeah, I know North, North. I know North Hollywood. Ah, well, Hollywood is not my city. It's my, my, my family. Okay, that's why, that's why, that's where they live. Yeah. 
Hollywood, too crowded for my taste. Demasiada gente para mi gusto. Yes, it is. Eh, it's a lot of people. <laughs> Lots of people. Yes. Okay, uh -huh. let's see. Thank you very much. Walter Ruiz, where are you, my friend? Hello, teacher. What would you like to do for vacation? Tell me. Mm, let me see. I would like not to receive any calls. Okay. You would like not to receive, not to get calls from your job, I imagine. Yeah. Thank you. What about you, Luis Armando? What would you like to do for vacation? Well, um, first, if I have money, <laughs> I would like to go to Australia. Okay. Australia. Australia. If I have money, money. Okay, just give me a second, guys. Money. I would like to travel to, to okay. Australia. Man, that fly uh -huh. is expensive. Ese viaje caro. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, we are talking the thousands there. Ya hablamos de miles. Yes. It's long. I mean, yes. 18 yeah. hours. Six, 16. 16 or 18 hours. Uh, well, with the time you stay in customs and in the flight and you have to stop in the United States, I guess it's Cali in South Unido. Yeah. yeah, 16 hours, 18 hours actually. You get 18 yeah. hours. Yeah. 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 You have you have to make the it stop there. Yeah. Good luck, man. Uh, Good luck. Buena suerte. I will go. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Evelyn, what about you, Miss? What would you like to do for vacation? Tell me. Um, in my case, I would like to go to Lake with my family. Where? Donde? I would like to go a lake. A lake. Lago. Yes, a lake. To a lake. Okay, that's cool. Excellent. Peaceful. Pacifico. Something peaceful. That's nice. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Arvin, what about you? What would you like to do for vacation? Um, I go to travel the beach. Oh, would you like, you would like to go to the beach. That's nice. Okay. Excellent. What about you, Elizabeth? Um, I would like to visit my mom in the United States. Oh, that's nice. I would like to visit my mom. Yes. Thank you. Ivania, your turn. Tell me. Teacher, um, I would like to um, travel in USA. Oh, to the USA? Yes. Where would you like to travel in the United States? Adonde? <laughs> what part of the United States? Um, I have... I have um, Relatives? Familia? Yeah, uh -huh, family. Uh, see, various families. Relatives. Relatives. Relative families in Oregon, in New York, in Georgia. Georgia? Yes. That far away, tan lejos. Yes. Um, I have co uh, prima. Yes. Cousins. Cousin. Mm -hmm. I have a cousin. In Georgia, man. How do they get that far? Como llegan tan lejos? That's awesome. <laughs> okay, let's see. And the last one is Susana. Tell me, Susana. Okay. I would like to know the new carretera. The new road? The new road for uh, La Libertad. Oh, be careful. Yes. Uh, be I careful. see. Con cuidado. That street is dangerous. But the new? Yeah, that one. 
Esa. Oh, dangerous. Okay. okay. Yeah, because I Only mean that the you, more I you can get I prefer faster. staying home. Yeah. Esa carretera es interesante for driving. Believe me, it's pretty interesting for driving. <laughs> okay. Even yes. and at yes. night is worse. Y por las noches es peor. Uh, watch out. Okay, guys, okay. I just need to get the attendance. Thank you very much to all of you, but I need to get the attendance. Just give me a second, a second, a second. Man, I'm sorry. Perdón por el retraso. I got excited. Disculpen, me emocioné y no me fijé en la hora. Please don't hate me. No me odien por ello. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. I got it. Alfonso Antonio Cabrera. Present, Present teacher. Arvin Enrique Ramos Mundo. Present teacher. Berta Maritza Molina absent. Claudia Guadalupe Alfaro absent. Daisy Elizabeth Celaya Gómez. Present teacher. Edwin Daniel Sevillano Deras. Present teacher. Evelyn Patricia Caballero de Molina. Present teacher. Ivania Elizabeth Rodríguez Ramos. Present teacher. Karen Lizette García Rodríguez absent. Luis Armando Leiva Rodas. Present teacher. A Mauricio Arnoldo Quintanilla Cuellar. Here, Oscar Armando Rodríguez Rodríguez absent, Ricardo Alberto Hernández Monge absent, Roxana Claribel Trejo de Pérez absent, Sandra Yanira Moreno Sarabia present, Sonia Mabel Lazo González present, Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta present, Vladimir Antonio Martínez Molina present teacher, Walter Alexander Arana Cortés present teacher, Walter José Ruiz Ayala Present teacher. Okay, I am so sorry, for real. Discúlpeme, de veras, lo siento. I lose track of time. Perdí no problem, teacher. Noción del tiempo. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Okay. Vladimir, you stay with me. Good night. See you Bye, tomorrow. guys. Take care. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Bye. Bye, tomorrow. Bye, bye. Have a good night. Bye, guys. Good night. Bye bye. Okay, Vladimir. Let's see. I need to talk to you, my friend. Okay. Uh, first, uh, I would like to know: uh, Is there any topic that we have uh, any type of problems? I got tema que no esté del todo claro. And not by the moment. Okay. Eh, solo la corrección aquella que yo estaba, estaba errado, la de going to, pero ya con lo que me enseñó, pues aprendí eso nuevo. Ok, now, how are we with the presentation for tomorrow? ¿Cómo estamos para, con la presentación para mañana? Ah, la puedo trabajar en la mañana en, el, en mi trabajo. Como le dije, mi jefa está de vacaciones, entonces no, estoy relax. Ok, if you want... A menos que suceda algo, pero igual. Hola. If you want, you can send it to me. Si quiere, me la puede enviar uh, after noon for la tarde i can sí. check it out and let you know if we need to fix something now uh, El, uh, vladimir i need you to me gustaría i would like you to practice reading necesito reading que practique lectura yes reading in english okay okay well actually i did it in my job but techni english at english technical english yeah, technical English. And that's the situation. That's what I want to talk to you about. You are pretty good with the technical English. Stand up muy bien with technical English. But also, uh, you also need um, everyday vocabulary. Because sometimes you get pretty technical. A veces se me vuelve muy técnico. And that's okay when you are talking to people who really understands your area. Yes. Es perfecto cuando se habla con personas que comprenden su área. But remember, uh, you are not going to use English just for that. In some situations, you will be faced with situations where you are asked to talk to people in a everyday fashion. Okay? okay. And in this case, as we live in a Spanish-speaking country, the only way where we can acquire vocabulary is through watching movies in English, Yes. Reading in English, but I think, I think, and correct me if I'm wrong. Corríjame si me equivoco. 
I think that your way of learning is more focused on reading. Creería yes. que su estilo de aprendizaje se enfoca más a la lectura. Sí, y escuchar webinars in English. Okay, so I need you to read like stories and stop. I will be helping you on that. Yo le voy a ayudar un poquito en ello. I will okay. be sending you vocabulary because I also need you to get um, modisms. Me gustaría que comience ya a trabajar con modismo. And I'm telling this because in your in your special and particular case, uh, your level of understanding is a little bit higher because you studied before. Usted o ya estudió yes. antes. So your understanding is a little bit higher. And there's still little things that you need to, to, to improve. Siempre hay pequeñas cosillas que uno necesita mejorar. You could have realized in these two levels. Creo que usted ya se ha dado cuenta en estos dos niveles que, I mean, it's a language. We are always learning. Es un idioma, siempre estamos aprendiendo. Sí. Even correcto. if they are basics. But I would also like you not to get like too comfortable. No lo quiero demasiado cómodo. So I will push you a little bit more with that. Lo voy a empujar un poquito más con eso. Okay. Okay. Gracias, so teacher. I will start uh, helping you because I, as I told you, I would like you to work in readings. Me gustaría que trabajara más en readings and how to apply them. Eh, cómo, cómo aplicarse en ellos and to analyze the, the different type of vocabulary que se meta ya un vocabulario separated from your technical English because I mean some of the words you use are pretty technical algunas palabras de las que usted me utiliza son muy técnicas and that's okay when somebody understands you Y está bien cuando lo habla con alguien que le entiende. In my case, I got some notions. Yo tengo nociones. So I can get some of your ideas. Yes. But sometimes when you are expressing your ideas, the problem is that is this. You express them correctly. A veces usted expresa sus ideas correctamente. But how do you explain them to somebody who's not adept to your area? ¿Cómo se las explica a alguien que no está en su área? Yeah, Eh, sí, de hecho ese es un problema porque uno es técnico y cuando le toca ir donde la gente que toma decisiones tiene que traducir el lenguaje técnico a, a lenguaje yeah. entendible para ellos. To layman's, eh, el lenguaje común. And how do we do that? Acquiring more vocabulary. ¿Y cómo lo hacemos? Adquiriendo más vocabulario. Si okay. alguna expresión en un momento uno no, no conoce la expresión exacta para explicarla in the other language, what you do is circumvallate. Lo que uno hace es circumvallate. What is this? When you explain the idea. Ah, okay. When you explain the word, like uh, uh, serendipity. What is serendipity? Oh, serendipity ooh, is the ability to find some things that you are not looking for. Oh, good. You see, what did I do? No le traduje la palabra. No. I explain the word or define the word in an easier way for you to understand. Actually, at UCA, the levels are in that in that form. So you, hey, teacher, what is the meaning of that word in English? The teacher explains it in English. Oh, that's the oh, Wow. <laughs> Yeah, and never and that, use Spanish. <laughs> and that's what I want you guys to get used to. Y eso es lo que yo quiero que ustedes se acostumbren. But okay. remember, the problem here is that we are working with vocabulary related to workplaces. Estamos trabajando con vocabulario relacionado con trabajo. So sí. it's easier when you get excited and you start talking about your work. But it's complex because imagine the imagine you are talking to Elizabeth. Elizabeth says the word patterns to you. But pattern is a word, un patrón, in your area, in su area, is a different term, right? For, for, for me and for her. Exactly, but it's the same word. Yes. Okay, now imagine that you need to explain the word to her. You will need vocabulary that it's easy for her to understand. Like the word from yesterday, teacher, drop. 
I oh, yeah. I know the world from my my area. Yeah, but look, hey man, I dropped my phone. Yes. <laughs> you see? And actually, you know, I sometimes I love to watch the drops of water when they fall. Uh, yes. <laughs> you see? And how do we remember all those vocabulary? Oh, because we see it in different contexts. And in our case, how do we see it in different contexts? Through reading. Reading is the key in your case. Okay. Es una de las so I'm sorry that I made you stay a little bit more. Perdone que Luis se quedarse, but I no, really wanted, wanted uh, to emphasize hecho, that to you. De hecho, estoy esperando que deje grabar para decirle algo, pero personal. Ah, yeah, no problem, no problem. And actually, it's time. It's time. So it was a pleasure to have you here in the class. Uh, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow Remember your homework. You got yes. your presentation tomorrow. Bye-bye. Take yes. care. Bye-bye.